Dr. Terry Bull back with you again. We had some fabulous suggestions for gifts. Uh, Lindsay Antwine wanted some human earwax candles. I know that seems a little weird, but you know what? Dr. Vaughn pulls out enough earwax, I think we've got enough for candles. I want to uh, work on some for you. Hey, uh, Paulie, did you uh, hand me the, uh, yeah, the mayo tray there. The mayo stand, whatever. Tomayo, tomayo. All right. So what we got here, human earwax. Now we can make this into some fabulous candle material. I mean, wax is wax, you know what I'm saying? Ah, oh, got a couple more in here. A couple more little nuggets. I feel like I'm on a cooking show or something. All right. We get these things, get them nice and pliable, squish them up nice, and we can form them into little cohesive pieces. They're very pliable when you squeeze them between your fingers. Very nice, very nice. Anyway, this is going to be a lengthy process, which we won't show you the entirety of, but we'll, we'll give you the, the basics and then we'll cut straight to the finished product. So as you can see, this process of making candles out of human earwax is very labor intensive. So I'm not sure what kind of a price we could put on this. It could be very expensive stuff. Nonetheless, I have created one and it's sort of the prototype. I, I'm rather proud of it. Uh, I think it could be used for uh, romantic dinners, if you follow my drift. It's beautiful. It's a gift that keeps on giving. I think most people would like to have it. So tell us what you think.